weekly recap. I have attached this palette to the wall, I have attached this air hose reel, and I have fixed this pink bicycle. That's it, see you next week, adios! You're joking. <laughs> Let's see what I did in details. So, yeah, finally I attached this palette to the wall. I disassembled and removed some parts that were not necessary. I had to cut it to fit the size uh, or the height of the workbench to be in one level because I plan to put something on the top, some shelves or something and um, paint it in black as you can see and I'm happy with the result I, I couldn't imagine how it will be but when I finish I'm actually really happy the only thing that now I miss the same on the other part and maybe in next weeks I will do that, I will do something similar from the scrap wood. Maybe I will have to find more palette for that, more additional wood. So, as you can see, I did that for... not only for decorating the wall, but now it's quite easy to attach some hooks, some holders or anything that is necessary. You just screw it uh, with some little screw and that's all. And I have this place for attaching something very easily when I need. I put uh, some tools now, but it's temporary. I can change it at any moment. Uh, maybe when I will get more tools, maybe I will decide to build some cabinets or some special holders for some chisels or I don't know what else, some, for something. And yeah, for that I like it because it's very easy when when I don't need something I unscrew it I screw something different and voila I will still have to manage the cables because this compressor doesn't have uh, any plug close I plan to put some cables somewhere behind this bench and to, to put some plugs maybe here or I don't know I didn't think yet but now I'm using this extender maybe I will rearrange the air hose I will see what we have in the hardware store. Maybe I will change the connection to go it down or to the side and I don't know, we will see. So why I'm happy about this project with Apollet is because I had a chance to test my new tools that I got on Christmas. Uh, if you didn't see my Christmas video, I recommend to watch it. I've got a bunch of tools and this was the first time when I used this track saw. I was really surprised with the result, how easy it is to use it. You just put the rail on the top where you need to cut. And that's all. Finish. I think it will be very useful for building my next workbenches, my wardrobes, shelves or whatever. I'm already happy with it. I don't remember how much I paid for it, but the prices for this brand are really, really low. And for that price, it's something like wow for me. <laughs> Super happy. Another tool that I tested, uh, I didn't prepare it, where it is, is this angle grinder. Nothing special, but it did its job. I cut some uh, nails from the palette when I was disassembling it. And so far I'm happy. Nothing to comment for this price. Uh, very essential tool in the workshop. Very happy. Tested this as well for the first time in this workshop. So far happy with the park site. The only tool that I'm not happy about uh, yet is this planer you could see it in my last weekly recap I was fixing my TV table with that the button here is so awful it's so hard to to push it sometimes you have to push this to the side and then to push the button but it doesn't start until you push until the last until the last end and you have to put some force I don't like this for that the only complaint so far that I have about Parkside tools. Okay, I will tidy up later. Uh, so next thing that I did 
was I fixed this pink bicycle and you cannot imagine how happy I am about that because the fix appeared to be so easy and so simple I thought that I will have to change the rear gear shift the shifter or how does it called I thought that I will have to change this part because it didn't have enough spring load in this part and the chain was always down it just didn't retract the the chain back and when I started to to work on this bicycle I, I couldn't figure out why I knew that it was because of the spring I disassembled it and I thought that the spring just lost its strength and I wanted to change the part completely but this week when I tried one more time I noticed that the spring is just jumping off its uh, fixing position or fixating point it's like a little hole on the on the back of the part so what i did i just drilled a hole a little bit bigger for for the spring clip to have some more 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 surface to support it i don't know how to say that. i don't know how to explain sorry but the result is that it was so simple and i'm so happy about it and there will be one more person who will be very happy about it is my girlfriend because i think she already lost hope <laughs> to see this bicycle uh, or to ride it because it's here already for one year can you imagine one year so this will go home today, I think. I will load it to the car and this will be a surprise for my girlfriend. I hope she will be really happy. By the way, if you are watching this, leave a comment and tell my girlfriend that these tires are just awful. I don't know if you can see, they have cracks. They are completely worn. At the beginning, I wanted to restore this bicycle completely, to repaint it, to renew the seats, the, the handles, the brakes, to, to make it nicer, because it's an old, classical, nice bicycle, and to restore it, to refurbish it would be really nice. I would like to, to have this project, but she <laughs> disagreed, she refused this option, she just want to ride it already, but at least I would like to change the tires because they are awful. They are not even safe to, to ride. Leave a comment, tell her that it's necessary to change the tires, please. <laughs> Maybe she will listen to you. And that's all. Uh, not too much again. I plan to do more things, but I plan to do more things every week or every day, but there's always something to distract me from working here and the progress is quite slow sometimes. But very happy with the things that I did this week. If next week will be similar in productivity, I will be very happy. Let me know if you like this palette on the wall, if you think it's useful or it's just something blah unnecessary or unprofessional but in my opinion it's quite handy to have some wooden wall and to attach something very easily because here the walls are stone or brick walls and every time you want to attach something you have to drill the, the wall itself to use the anchors special anchors and it's a bit slower and not so much fun then just to take the screw and done. That's all. See you next week. Bye.